We were engaged to construct the top of one Barangaroo, room, which included the supply and installation of permanent and temporary structural steel, tower crane grillages, roof and facade steel packages, and to install the 200 ton opposed pendulum tune mass dampener known as the TMD. The TMD was required to dampen the structure against winds that cause harmonic vibration. The architect described the complex, twisted structural form as almost impossible to construct. At our first meeting, our client emphasised the following key problems to resolve. The activities were on critical path, that safety would not be compromised as the workers were rigging at a height of 270 metres on the highest roof in Sydney, and that we had a single tower crane to perform the works in a very short period of time. To ensure this project was done to the highest quality, reduced potential safety hazards and completed as per the schedule, it was proposed to use the principles of DFMA, which is Design for Manufacture and Assembly. The key elements we had to overcome were crane capacity. The biggest single lift was over 21 tonnes, which is right on the limit of the tower crane. Transport. Initially, the biggest piece was 15 metres by 6 metres, which was difficult to transport into break room. Modularization. How best to reduce the number of lifts with the constraints and with intolerances. The original design was not optimised for modularization, as there was nothing typical about the project. We were able to find solutions to these problems by executing the following. Design development and 3D modelling. 3D modelling was used for design development, coordination and to produce the CNC cutting files. We also utilised the model to produce the install sequence drawings. For every single unique weld, plate, bolt, lifting lug, connection and facade bracket, we 3D modelled in Tecla structures to a level of detail 400. Working from heights. We incorporated a pre-installed edge protection system. Elimination of falling objects by optimising connections. We moved connections away from the edge. We pre-installed nuts and washers to the structure. Off-site pre-assembly. We pre-assembled the whole structure in the workshop to ensure the twisted geometry fit together within one millimetre structural tolerance. The result, 7,714 unique pieces were fabricated off-site, all custom made to suit what the architect describes as an almost impossible geometry. 515 unique assemblies were delivered to site. These assemblies were modularised into 200 crane lifts. This reduced the tower crane usage by three weeks. Zero incidents, and zero lost time injuries occurred during construction. For lift one, our biggest single lift, we assembled the structure on bespoke engineered jigs to suit the angle of the final position. This was pre-assembled with a 45 ton mobile crane on site. Once on-site assembly was complete and signed off, we used a 400 ton mobile crane to transfer the lift one module to the main tower crane which hoisted the load to a height of 270 metres. As the lift was right on capacity of the crane, the load itself was close to the facade during hoisting. We adopted the same principles with the install of the 200 tonne TMD. Each piece was sized and pre-assembled to maximum transportable dimensions and within the crane capacity. The final position was hydraulically jacked into position prior to commissioning. The outcome was good design that implemented DFMA principles, which enabled the project to be executed ahead of schedule. Through passion, collaboration, and commitment to delivery, we were able to ensure the safe construction of the crown for one Barangaroo.